take the RV? Yeah. <laughs> Evie, we're going to go tent camping. We yeah. get to sleep in a tent. Yeah, but I, I want to do that one. You want to do that one too? We are packing up, about to head out on our first tent camping trip as a family of three. It is the weekend and we are so excited. We're getting up early, so hopefully the campsite that we're going to is a like first come first serve campsite. So hopefully we'll find a spot available there. If not, we'll go to the next um, area. But we're so excited. Are you excited? Yeah, I have a boo boo. You do. He had a scabby kept picking, so we had to put a band-aid on it, didn't we? Yeah. But it'll heal, won't it? You have what? I have a lot of owies. Oh, you have a lot of owies. Yeah. Yeah, you Where's do. We are packing everything in our big two totes. Um, and then, I'm trying to think of what else. Both of us, we have so much stuff. Like, tent camping like this is like glamping because... And with kids, it just adds on, you know, but we've got two totes, one, two, three, four, four bags of bedding, just just bedding and blankets, because it's supposed to be cold. It's gonna get down to like 30 one night. Um, we've got two suitcases of clothes and our folding table, and then just all the food. So, and then of course we have to bring kids activities, balls, um, we're bringing the boys softball um, and their gloves. So Austin's got the truck pulled up and we're getting it packed. We're gonna head out. driving out to the Buffalo Rivers where we're camping this weekend. Holy cow. Gideon, do you want to see the elk? We pulled off in, so, I want to see the elk. years ago, Evie, you want to, I'll buckle Evie, Gideon. Come on. Years ago, Arkansas, did they, what did they do with elk? They, they um, brought some elk and put them in the Ozark Mountains out here in Boxley, Arkansas. And, it's like an hour and a half from our house, but there's a literally there's this look off point where nearly almost every time you come, you can see elk. So we just got here on our way, and you can see there's a whole herd of elk. Austin is so excited because you know he goes to Colorado to go elk hunting, and so for him, it's like you can't see him in Colorado. He didn't find any in Colorado this year, but we can come to Arkansas and find some. My first time. This is your first time seeing elk, isn't it? Oh, I guess you saw him one time. Okay, we gotta be really quiet. Hold on, I'm gonna video the elk real quick. Look at them, there's a whole herd of them over there. Do you see the elk over there, Evie? Yeah. Do you see the, the way over there? Look, they're way over there. I don't have my phone. There he goes, he's standing up. The boys? out here. I was not expecting this many people. Oh, no way. 
Yeah, this is stunning. We made it to the campsite. We have picked out where we're gonna stay. Gideon's already unpacking his toys and stuff that he brought. Now it's time to get the camp set up. It's gonna be fun. <laughs> we're camping with um, three other families and all of us have at least like two kids, if not more. So it's gonna be a blast. I'm so, so excited. Okay, we made it. We are setting up camps. Let's see how long this takes. We've got a lot of stuff. Um, we've got four sites reserved like down this row, but look at the view, seriously. It is Mom. stunning. Mom. I keep saying that, I'm gonna be saying it all weekend, but I'm so excited. Mama. We got our friends, one family's already here, two more to come. Um, it's gonna be the best Mama, time. We're gonna have the best weekend. Gideon, what are you ready to do? Play me. What is that? Which way Set. Do you want the door Softball. Um, babe, let's face it. Let's face it. I want to face it. Um, no, I want to face it this way. Yeah, it's too high. Don't do that. Okay, just don't go from that way. Come on, this is a frisbee. Look. Go get it. Hey, Carter has his baseball. You can ask him. Which one do you want? Do you want that one or this one? Okay. You want that one? Okay. Don't get it on yet because you you have you're get dirty. The mouse. Yep. We're gonna go get your mouse and Gideon's lion and your bed and your pillow and your blanket. Where is it? It's in the truck. Um, we got our table and our cooler set up and our chairs and our tent is all set up. Austin brought a um, little propane heater that before we go to bed he's gonna like warm it up and then we are gonna hopefully stay warm. I got the kids beds made. We've got our tote of food, our tote of like extra camping supplies, the kids toys, 
and let's take a tour. Right here is Evie's bed and we've got her like three warm blankets. Um, these cots are amazing. I will link them on my um, on my like to know page on they're from Amazon but I will find those and link them for you because those are probably one of the best things um, we have got. I say we have them. They're Austin's moms but um, they work really well for getting the kids up off the ground um, so they're not on the cold floor and then they have their um, it holds up really well so they can't roll off. And then there's Gideon's bed with his sleeping bag that he got from Aunt Megan. We've got the kids clothes in that suitcase. Austin and I's bed and then our clothes in that suitcase with the dirty Can diaper. I go in? A dirty diaper on top of course. That just adds to the decor and the smell. Okay, medicine first aid box that I made. Um, we've got toiletries, water beads, um, plates and bowls. We've got a baby carrier down here. Let's see what's in here. Well, we've got the kids' lanterns yeah. for tonight. Got a lighter, extra charging pack, some more toiletries, Austin's hammock, extra toilet paper, paper towels, um, spoons and forks. We brought a speaker for music and my Bible and my study book. So not really a lot of camping stuff. It's just kind of extra because we can tote. Of course, we got the kids' cute camping chairs. These I'm going to try and link. Those were from Walmart for like nine bucks. I got them last year on sale. They were so cute. I'll try and find something similar. But <sighs> I'm just so happy to finally have like everything set up and the kids like already just not having cell service for the next few days is gonna be really nice. I feel like for me it's gonna be nice, but it's also, I've, it's also gonna be like hard, which normally I'm not like glued to my phone all the time, but more recently I have been um, with just social media and whatnot, YouTube. And so, anyway, it's gonna be nice not to have cell service, not to be distracted and just enjoy the here and now enjoy my kids, enjoy our fellowship with our friends from church, and yeah, just enjoying God's creation, nature, going down to the river, it would be so much fun. We have been outdone. Are you kidding me? <laughs> That's so pretty. Going overboard at all? <laughs> Maybe a little. <laughs> hey, if you can, why not? I Why guess. Not? They got string lights. They brought their like huge grill. Look at that. A black stone grill. Just growing up a steak. Man, that is five star. She's brought fall decor for the kids to paint pumpkins. I'm not that crazy. That's so cute. Oh, I love it. The kids are having the best time. Let me see it. Oh wow, is it cute? Yes, yeah, it's gorgeous. It's gorgeous.
Say good night. Say good night. Oh yeah, there's shadows on the wall. That's cool. Hey Evie, Look. can you say good night? Good night. Look, it's a sunny one. Yeah, that's cool. I look at my own. Okay, the kids are going to bed. They're wore out, but they're like super excited about sleeping in the tent. So we will see how they do tonight. I'm gonna sit in here until they go to sleep. I'm gonna go sit by the campfire. There. Really tired, but you know, over time. Anyway. Do it. Cool, Evie. Anyway, we're gonna head to bed. Um, pretty soon. We will see y'all in the morning. Good morning. <sighs> I feel like I slept really well last night. Um, I only woke up once with Gunner. He was a little fussy and hungry. Say hi. But, um, I really slept really good last night. I was exhausted when we went to bed. The kids finally. <sighs> Evie was out. Gideon kept waking up. And he thought it was so cool that we were camping that he was sleeping in a tent. So he just could not hardly fall asleep. Um, but anyway, we survived the night. It went really well. Um, we have our big comforter from our bed. So it really, like to me, felt like we were at home and the weather, like it was not too cold, which I was thinking it was gonna be a lot colder. But somehow, um, in the tent, it it stayed like pretty warm actually. Somehow it held in heat. So that was great. Anyway, Evie woke up not till like eight o'clock, Gideon got up at like 8 30 um i just got him dressed and he ran out and gunner and i are gonna go head out and get some breakfast aren't we bud say hi friends hi friends <laughs> it just started to rain like of course when we're tent camping it starts raining but we will see how long we can make this last Cute. Okay, Adrian, I'm gonna go check on What are y'all doing? Do you wanna get in the hammock? Sure, bed. Abby, what do you got? A hot chocolate. Oh my goodness. With marshmallows. Twix. With wow. marshmallows. So Hazel's cute. got Gunner. Hey Gunner! Gunner bugs! He's so chubby. I know, look at those little legs. What? It's the wrong. What's wrong? He's tired. We are hiking down. It's not very far. We're hiking down to the edge of the Buffalo River. Anyway, it's like probably just a quarter mile little trail that takes you down to the river. Gorgeous. A house. What do you think, babe? 
And this is stunning. Just a couple more weeks and the colors out here will be popping. Popping. Popping, popping. Evie, look at this. place was so fun the kids they have so many things for kids and just teaching them about nature and conservation and it's just <laughs> the kids had the best time <laughs> learning and playing anyway so we're gonna go um, see some more elk um, in that overlook again and then we're gonna head back to the campsite and make some supper chopping firewood and I'm making foil dinners which is basically dinner that you cook in foil so I've got potatoes onions and I've got ground meat that I seasoned with ketchup liquid aminos and some garlic and onion powder hey Beckett you need to ask your mom before you open that anyway we're gonna wrap it up in foil and throw this on the fire and let it cook until potatoes are soft so it should be delicious I'm excited of course we made way more than we're actually gonna eat but we'll share it with our friends Austin has got this tent packing down to a science. He's pretty good at it. We got our tent packed up. We got our totes pretty much ready to go. And we load everything in the truck. We are ahead of schedule. So we're looking good. Hang out for a little while and then head home. We gotta unpack our tent again because it still is wet from the heavy dew here by the river. Um, so we'll do that later today. And let it air out, wash it, and then pack it up tomorrow. Anyway, 
Gunner, what do you think, bud? What you think? Is it bright out here? Is it cold? Yeah. Gideon, did you have fun? You ready to head home? Come here, baby. What? Hmm? Baby, what? You are ready to head home? What? 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 Abby, did you have fun? Yeah. Y'all ready to go home or y'all want to stay? Go. <laughs> well, that wraps up this week. We had a great time doing some fall camping. We will see y'all next week. Bye. See you. You're not gonna. You're not gonna do it. Nope. You're not gonna do it.